Hi, I'm Lex Kravitz, and in this video I'm going to demonstrate the feeding experimentation device version 3, which we're calling Fed3. Fed3 is open source, and the designs are freely available at the Hackaday link. Fed3 was designed to free researchers from the model of expensive, rigid behavioral equipment and allow them to do their experiments wherever they'd like, such as in rack-mounted home cages or even inside of other scientific equipment. It was also designed to be cheap enough for high-throughput behavioral experiments, costs about $150 to build a device like this one, and with future optimizations we hope to bring the price down. Finally, we designed Fed3 to be flexible. It's relatively easy to add new functionality, new sensors, or new codes which enable new experiments. To achieve these goals, Fed3 is battery powered, it's fully contained, and all the code and designs are open source. I'm going to do a quick overview of the hardware in this video, and in the next videos I'll look at how to build a Fed3 and, how, and show some example programs for training mice. So Fed3 has two nose pokes, a left poke and a right poke for the mice to interact with. It has a pellet dispenser that detects when a pellet is present and when the pellet is removed. It has eight multicolor LEDs for visual stimuli, an audio generator, a screen for user feedback, and a programmable analog output that can be used to send data to other equipment such as LEDs or electrophysiology equipment in real time. Finally, Fed has an SD card slot for writing all of the data. I'm going to show you a quick demonstration, turning it on in the back. We'll see the screen doing a pattern, and then see the stimuli operating. So that's Fed 3.